Oh my god, I, dude, I missed this so much. Obviously, we gotta go with my boy. My boy. And let's go. An exception has occurred already. We didn't even do anything. I regret everything that I did wrong. I did so much wrong to everyone, but I can fix this now, I think. I hope so. Oh shit. Monica, what you trying to do, girl? Oh, restored. That should do it. Yes, I'm feeling better already. Who else should I bring back? I think that I'll give Sayori a fair chance this time. What about the others? Let's see what happens if I leave them gone for now. Ooh, ooh, okay. That's kind of cool. Maybe then I will have a fair chance at this game. If that causes any problems, then I can fix them as things go on. Hey, okay, she restored Sayori. Now just to repair what I can of the game script, then restart the game. Here goes nothing. <laughs> hey. I see a girl running toward me from the distance, waving her arms and in the air like she's totally oblivious to any attention she might draw to herself. That girl is Sayori, my neighbor and good friend since we were children. I idle in front of the crosswalk and let Sayori catch up to me. Hey, 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 yeah, little bitch, just a little gay, yeah, with the red bow, yeah, looking kind of flame, hey, yeah, say or a, yeah, stupid little bitty sucking up on this mother, the fucking dicky every day, day, yeah, yeah, what, use a bitch, a mana K, K, yo, where you at, girl, yeah, I know you fucking reading me, and you watching this big old motherfucking D, hey, yeah, suck up on these nuts, yeah, cause they're massive ass fuck, yeah, bitch, yeah, hey, lick up on this fucking clit, it's like, I don't have one, cause that's gay as fucking shit, swag, hey, <laughs> I miss this so much. I'm having an amazing time. This is so fun. Oh my god, and nothing's even happened yet. <laughs> Doing dishes. I love you, man. I should- I need to do my dishes, too. They're piling up, bro. They're piling up. But I'm playing mods instead. <laughs> After I pick up my things, I stare blankly at the wall looking for an, an ounce of motivation. Clubs. Sayori wants me to check out some clubs. I thought you might need some encouragement, so I thought, you know... Know what? Well, that you could come to my club. Sayori. Yeah? I let out a long sigh. <sighs> Bruh. Sayori, full of energy, swings open the classroom door. <sniffs> Monica, the new member is here. Eh? I glance around the room. Ah, Lube. What a nice surprise. Hey, yeah, hey, join the fucking club, bitch. Yeah, Monica's sucking on my dick. Yeah. <laughs> All words escape me in this situation. Monica is an incredibly cute girl. I know Monica. Did I? <laughs> How did I forget about Monica? We had class together last year. It's great to see you again, Lube. Monica smiles sweetly. Hell oh, yeah, she does, bro. Like, come on, but like, hey. Monica was probably the most popular girl in class. Smart, beautiful, athletic. She can do the splits. On my penis. Monica especially seems really pleasing to look at. <laughs> what the fuck? Even more so than usual somehow. It's the music going in your ears. It's 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 making you fall in love. It must be hard to start a new club. Well, <laughs> uh, uh, she's laughing. What the fuck's going on? Whoa, hey, what the fuck's happening? Girl, I got these, I got these headphones turned up way too loud for you to be doing this shit, okay? Um... We had two other members. For some reason, they are running late today. Intergalactic entity. Facts pack, bro. You see her laughing for like 20 seconds straight? That was fucking weird. Ba -da 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 -da. Us three will go home and each write a poem of our own. That's weird. She just came up with it. But I mean, fuck it, bro. She knows about everything. She remembers everything that happened. Both girls stare back at me with the with the de dejected eyes. Fuck you, Luke. You fucking read, bro. Read. <laughs> Sayori moves to the side of the classroom. Why aren't you centered? I know it's a mod, and it's probably just something that they 
just didn't do but it freaks me out that you're not centered right now <laughs> quite understand what the fuck suddenly a small girl busts into the club and then interjects herself in the middle of a conversation and what the fuck a second taller girl follows her <laughs> the smaller pink girl pink haired girl starts to speak what's going on here monica seriously you brought a you brought your boyfriend <laughs> what the hell what the fuck are you looking at <laughs> what <laughs> what's this bitch on bro if you want to say something say it Natsuki glares at me. S sorry. This is Natsuki, always full of energy. And this is Yuri, the smartest in the club. Hey, don't be closing your eyes. Hey, 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 don't be closing your eyes like that, please. <laughs> I'm, I'm on edge again, and I love it. Uh, hey, 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 hey. Make your choice, player. Manga. We're all about the manga over here, boys. The real horror is often very successful in changing the way you look at the world, if even for a brief moment. There's nothing like reading about innocent people about... There's nothing like reading about innocent people being bought, bloodily hacked to death, limb by limb from limb, to give you a perspective on the incredibly meaning, incredible meaninglessness of it all. Ugh, I hate horror. Yeah, that was kind of foul, Yuri. Lube... I look forward to seeing how you express yourself. Who <laughs> is Monica? <laughs> Where are we going to go after this? The whole way my mind wanders back and forth between the four girls, Sayori, Monica, Natsuki, and of course, of course, Yuri. <laughs> what can I say? We've we've always been a fan of Yuri. We've always been a fan of Yuri. And it's nice. It's nice to finally see me in the game also feeling the same way. Love this girl. I love this. I. Hey, 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 whoa. Oh, we're only writing it for them? It's time to write a poem. Delete. Yo, we can write for Monica? This is sick. Code. Color. Um, binary. Did I try and write for Yuri? Oh, let's write for Monica. Let's write for Monica. Essence dripping down her fucking lips because it just sucked up on the biggest fucking dick. Okay, we're, 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 oh my god, we're hitting a bunch of Yuri's. Abyss. Everybody knows such a fucking, hey, straight as fuck. Yeah, yeah, hey, pink hair on the fucking screen. Yeah, hey, yeah, look at this fucking D. Yeah, it's fucking massive because I got big ass double D's in my fucking face. Yeah. If only she weren't so unapproachable. If only I weren't such a loser, and she wasn't out of my league. What am I saying? If only I could be with just Monica. Just Monica, just Monica, just Monica. Hey, bitch. What? I open my eyes to find Monica's face smiling. Uh, what the fuck? I nearly fall out of my chair. <laughs> Did I scare you? Anyway, I have been thinking a lot about you lately. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> Hey, yeah, maybe almost too much. Huh? Why would this babe be thinking about me? <laughs> Let alone caring about me. I have nothing to offer her. She's beyond my league. I'm such a loser. <laughs> I like you so much, Lou. Whoa, I like you. There's just something very special about you. My heart is starting to pound from these emotions swelling up between Monica and me. Am I going crazy? Is this real? I need you, Lou. Oh, hey, hey, fucking back up. I like you so much. So much, Lou. Me and Monica hold each other. After a short time, she gently nudges me to turn around. What? Hey, hey. I didn't, I, I don't, what the fuck is this? Hey, she's handing me her poem. Wait, no, no, no. Every day I imagine a few, it's the song. Why does she look like a cat? Oh, that's her ass. I thought... <laughs> Monica goes back towards the middle of the room. Hey. <laughs> Time to get back on track for the club. To serve as an antidepressant. But I remember every day I cry for my depression to go away. She's very open about it this time around. Whoa, hey. 
What's going on here, bro? Yeah, yeah stop! <laughs> I missed this so much. I love this. How are you gonna be going around convincing people you have real legs? Is that fucked up? <laughs> Maybe I'm fruity. <laughs> I feel like it's speaking to me personally. <laughs> okay, I did read it right. You don't have to go out of your way to flirt with me like this, Lube. <laughs> flirt with you! <laughs> Ayo, Luke, I saw that TikTok repost of you showcasing the DDLC many figures. Just want to know when you're going to put them in a jar. I'll come back with some more progress later on. Hey, what's my girl Yuri doing down there, bro? What's my girl Yuri doing down there? She's all like... It's just about time. Do you know what's in this cup? Do you know what's in this cup? I'm not gonna say what's in this cup. Pen? What the fuck? Yuri stole my pen. My mind goes blank and I feel some sort of pressure in my head. Luke? Are you feeling okay? Please respond. Hey, your boy just passed out. I suddenly pass out. I find myself in some sort of dream state. I wanted to thank you for spending so much time with us. You worked so hard to make each and every one of us happy. You comforted us through our time, our hard times. I wake up in the hospital. Sayori is with me comforting me. Can you put some fucking commas, please? I almost feel as if I'm not here. My mind is in a state of shock. I had a heart attack and stopped breathing for a short while, apparently. Do you want to read it? Sure, hand it to me. You, of all people. Eh, I didn't say I don't like it. Besides, what do you mean, you of all people? Because it's right in your name. Ma Nika. I love the music in this game. It is honestly the best soundtrack I've ever fucking heard for a game ever. I'm soon back home from visiting Sayori. A few minutes pass and I already hear a knock at my door. That must be Monica knocking. I gently open the door. Hi, Lube. How are you doing? Good, Monica. Please come inside. She follows me to my house. We take seats on the couch. Hey! What are you wearing? You look weird. Why is your neck like... Bro, what is this shade of color? That is not your neck color, fucking Monica. <laughs> Just... Well, how about some milk? <laughs> we walk to the restaurant. The sky is getting cloudy and rather dark. Are we at the restaurant now? What is this background? This looks so bad. <laughs> oh my god. I was trying to lose weight. This is about to get really weird, guys. I get really weird. My butt looks so fat. I cringe somewhat at that sentence. Dude, I did too, bro. That's crazy. Monica, you're fine. You look great. Monica smirks lightly, which I barely managed to notice. Well, my hips are huge. Don't you think so? <laughs> I don't know what to say to this, and I don't have time to think it over, unfortunately. Uh, I like your figure. As I said, you look great. I don't know when you're- I don't know why you're so- What the fuck? I don't know why you're nervous about it. Well, I just don't want to get fat, that's all. <laughs> I fuck fats. You're so cute sometimes, Lube. We're in, boys. We're in for sure. You're a nice guy. Oh, no. We're not- oh, Fuck, bro. Fuck, bro. <laughs> she did it to you, man. She did it to you, man. The writing is so bad, it makes me second-guess myself. I was just thinking about how nice that is, that you're such close friends with her. I raised my eyebrow. What's Monica trying to get at here? She's gonna kill Sayori. 
A few minutes pass as we continue walking. Just a little wet. We're okay. Yeah, we're fine. That scared the fuck out of me. Oh, I understand, Monica. Where are my parents? It's just a thought. Like, what the fuck? Where are they? We can either share the bed or you can sleep in it, and I can go to the sleep on one of the couches. We can share your bed. That, that'll be fine. Okay, then. This guy's such a loser. Tell me why me. What's up with me? Why would I even give her the chance to tell me to leave? If I, if I was like, bro, what the fuck's wrong with me? Oh, I can, I, I can give you the bed if you want. I'll go sleep on the couch. <laughs> what a fucking beta bitch, dude. I do some internet. I do some internet browsing. Oh yeah, yo yeah yeah yeah. Hey, you guys fuck with Nightcore, bro? What am I looking at here? I'm just going to try and relax tonight. I'll worry about school and the girls tomorrow. It's been a tough day. Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. Okay. Is that- bro, that's it? I'm so disappointed. I mean, it wasn't very good, but I was at least expecting it to be finished. I think we literally just go to a pool with <laughs> the girls. <laughs> it's it's really weird saying it out loud, but uh, I think I'm pretty sure that's it. Dude, this shit is so heat, bro. Well, that you could come to, you know, my club and squeakies in the chat. Hey, hey, yeah, let's look up on some dicks together. And we licking up on this shit because we are brothers. Hey, yeah, brothers with blood. Yeah, hey, because we dap up on our cocks when we, when we nut. <laughs> That's crazy, bro. Song legit vibe. Dude, I cannot tell you how much I listened to the Doki Doki um, soundtrack. Pull it up. You want me to pull it up now? <laughs> so here's my um, listens for all the Doki Doki songs. So this is the the um, like uh, theme song, like the the main menu music, I've listened to it 126 times all the way through. <laughs> why, why are you hellbent on me coming anyway? Well... Get the fuck, get the fuck out, get the fuck out of here, Sayori. Fucking type shit, get the fuck out of here, bro. This is why you're a third best girl. Hey, 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 the new member is here. Slow your roll there, Sayori. Don't call me a new me- Burt. Oh my. Yuri bad or is it just me? That depends on what kind of bad you're talking about. You're talking about bad as an evil? No. Well. Probably not in this one. But in bad as in... Baddie? I can't answer questions like that, man. I can't answer questions like that, bro. It's getting really fucking hot in here. <laughs> okay, okay. We, we'll do some voices. Natsuki lifts the foil off the tray to reveal a dozen white fluffy cupcakes decorated to look like little cats. The whiskers are drawn with icing. The little pieces of chocolate were used to make the ears. So, so cute. <laughs> I just turned into fucking Jimmy from goddamn uh, uh, South Park. <laughs> Give Natsuki Craig's voice. I can do that. Is so good, Natsuki. Holy crap. Is this cream cheese icing? Seriously, these are great. Yeah, it's real. It's made from scratch, right from Natsuki herself. Wink. Downing my second cupcake and beginning to unwrap a third. Dude, my, dude, what am I fat as fuck in this version? Holy shit! Fucking Monica put a little secret formula. <laughs> Egg, lube, 
try some of my secret formula. <laughs> this bitch is fucking with me already. I don't, I'm not vibing with her yet. See, because I, I don't know if you guys saw the new video. Check out the new video on YouTube if you didn't see it. Um, we ranked Monica fourth out of all the girls, right? And that's simply because I, she, I don't know. She's basic. Basic as fuck. There's nothing really that cool about her besides how she looks, you know? Hey, yeah, hey, she writing poems about me, yeah, and this bitch about to suck up on my D, hey, yeah, what's up, Yuri, hey, yeah, yeah, come back to my place and uh, have some tea, what's up? <laughs> your cupcakes, your, your poems, everything you do is just so cute, it's cute to do it. Say so worry, uh, <laughs> sidles, is that a word? Or is that a typo? I don't know, I might be stupid. Sidles up behind um natsuki and puts her hands on her shoulders you're you're okay i guess i'll give you a pass for now the impasse natsuki where'd you get that from natsuki where did you get that from where'd she get that from guys the, the impasse sure why not yay yay <laughs> i know that you love all of us in your own way i love these girls too and you, of course. It's interesting, Monica, because I put you fourth on the best girl list, so. And we could, you know. Hey, yeah, hey, hey, little bitty, just a little fucking gay, yeah. About to read a book with a stupid bitch all day, yeah, yeah, what's up? And then we gonna discuss it, gonna talk about our feelings and shit, gonna suck up on this motherfucking big old fucking dick, yeah, hey, hey. Why do I feel like this is not right? Let me look up the. The, the mod real quick. I feel like I'm playing the wrong mod here. <laughs> am I playing? I'm not playing the wrong mod, am I? <laughs> I'm playing the wrong fucking mod. Oh my god, there's no way. There's no way. Wow, I'm really playing the wrong mod. <laughs> that is so funny. Da, 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 da. I did a little bit of digging. Uh, it was very hard to get the, the download for this one, but I did. And we're here to play it tonight. Um, apparently this the, the link is just literally nowhere. You can't find it unless you use the Wayback Machine. And I used the Wayback Machine and got this stupid fucking mod. So this is a DDLC Summertime mod. God damn, they all start the same fucking way. A little long sigh. Say, so you're, tr you're trying to bribe me with food somebody else made. Don't you see anything wrong with that? Well, I told you already. I'll think about it. Until then, I'm not interested. Sorry. Okay. We said, fuck that bitch. I'm going to read manga. Whoa. Whoa, what the fuck? Hey, 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 yo, hey. Is the mod over? <laughs> that was a pretty sick mod. I'm sorry, but this music is fucking good. Games. Now that's my thing. Can't wait until I go home. Lube? That's an oddly familiar voice. Sayori, my girl, what you doing? What you doing here? In the fucking Juban district type shit. Got some big anime titties back here. Hey, you're Lube, right? <laughs> hey, Monica. Hey, put in Monica. <laughs> Going swimming. Monica said they have a discount on tickets for students and invited me to join her. This is such a good little bop, bro. Well, I was just thinking, you know, <laughs> this is going to turn into a Morty voice. I, I just feel it. Might as well fucking commit. Sayori seems a bit flustered. Was she like this before? Want to join us, Lube? Yeah, that. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> All right, Monica. I'll meet you two there. But first, I have to go home and get geared up. Geared up? Is this guy a fucking goober? Going to the pool? Let me let me go grab my gear real quick. <laughs> Pulls out fucking floaties. Goddamn s flippers. Look at little Miss Monica and her fucking, she's got her hair ties on her wrist. Yeah, they're looking a little cute. Do you know the way? Sure, this is kind of out of my comfort zone too, but thinking about it, seeing Monica in a bikini? Oh my god! Back to the pool, I'm searching for Sayori and Monica. Maybe they're just swimming and I don't recognize them in swimwear. I stand next to the pool. Hey, hey, what the fuck? Yeah! <laughs> Hey. Hey, hey, 
Hey, yeah. Yeah. Hey, Sayori in the pool, and she's sucking on this like I'm about to bull. <laughs> it's really deep on the other side, dude. Does Buddy not know how to fucking swim? Yeah! I feel a little bit weird now. One plus one is three. Can't change your mind. I think you're right, my boy. I think you're right. You, you put up a really good argument. It's 45. Wait, wait, wait. Fuck. Hold on. Let, let me... Fuck. God. I hope we'll see each other sometime, some other time, Monica. See me in general or just... Oh, whoa. Hey, yo, relax, relax. See me in general or just in my swimsuit? Hey, that's fucking... Yeah, yeah. Monica, relax. Monica, relax. Yo, if a, if a girl said that to me in real life, oh my god, do you know how fucking fast I would drop some sarcasm on her bitch ass? No. Normal clothes are fine, thank you. <laughs> anyway, I gotta go. Stay safe. What is there, a fucking hurricane coming? What are you saying that shit for? I'm going to be standing here until they close the place if we keep messing around. Come on, Sayori. Come on, you fucking stupid bitch. <laughs> All right, boys. Hey, what's up, fucking Sayori, little bitch? On the bus, we sit. Dude, this is so cool how they like do these like little moving backgrounds. To, like, I love this. This is a good mod. I had I had fun because of Sayori. No, thank you for inviting me. Oh wait, this is this isn't, this isn't me speaking. This is Lube. I'll see you around like a donut. All right, I'm about to be someone's fucking ass. Who wrote this? I head down to the kitchen to refuel my tank. Oh my god. <laughs> Can whoever the whoever wrote this needs to shut the fuck up. Should I read this really exaggerated? Goes in my bowl, milk on top, strictly in that order. Filled up with the essentials, sugar and liquid. I get dressed and leave the house. <laughs> As I'm approaching the bus stop, I see somebody sitting there, literally, looking down. Sayori again. Gosh, I don't remember seeing Sayori like this before. Maybe a joke would bring a smile to her face. Why did the chicken cross the road? Uh huh? Lube, hey. Her expression changes as abruptly as the face on her digital <laughs> clock. <laughs> I'll just assume the option I might be true. Here goes nothing. So you'd be fine with me joining. There aren't a lot of people in the park. Some are walking their dogs. Others walking with friends or a partner. I'm sorry. Yuri looks so bad. <laughs> why Why did she has like little fucking squiggles like someone f like fucking has Parkinson's when drawing her titties. Uh, what was my voice for Natsuki? Get off of me, you monkey. Whoa, whoa. Natsuki. That is extremely racist. Yeah, and you better be, uh, and you better not have come here just for a, a free sample. Natsuki seems very certain that if the, that it was food that brought me here, I was hoping for something sweet, but not necessarily edible. If that ain't the worst fucking thing I've ever heard a man say in my life, I know I'd be rapping about like fucking like clit and suck a dick but this is foul <laughs> it's funny though it's funny i hope this was like written ironically but i have a a huge feeling <laughs> that it wasn't let's get a bra times four in chat for this one uh well sayori seemed excited meeting you all and so i assumed you're a cool bunch <laughs> oh, I also visited a zoo. They let me pet a lot of animals, dolphins, turtles, owls. Owls? What the fuck? Did you go in the middle of the night? I even fed the monkey some bananas. Dude, this girl and her monkeys. What's up with what, what, Natsuki? Is there something you're not fucking telling us? Did you pet any koala? Did, did, did you pet any, any koalas? <laughs> no, they wouldn't let me. Yeah, yeah, I guess you didn't have the pepper. Uh, koala qualifications. <laughs> Bruh. 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 Uh, I, I prefer other forms of story storytelling. Other forms, like theater? Millies sing everything on the big screen, right? Ma this is a bit about to say manga. Now my girl, <laughs> my girl about to say manga. Wh whatever. I came prepared. Prepared to disappoint. Like, games? Ah, this fucking idiot. This guy has no fucking game. Oh my god. That's why you at least read one fucking book. One book. If a bitch likes books, 
You read one book, and you have a book to talk about. That's Suki. Manga. <laughs> <laughs> you might be surprised, but we actually played games a couple times in the club. Remember? We played Hangman. <laughs> yeah, I bet Sayori didn't like that one. Each round, we are given an acronym, and everyone tries to guess what it means. Yeah, well, well okay, yeah, Monica, but that, that's cool. But, but first, could you tell me what a... Could you tell me what an acronym is? Let me pull up my phone real quick. I, not because I'm looking up the definition or anything, but, but actually because, I, I, you know, I just... My mommy texts me. <laughs> Solvy boy, you're cute. Acronym. This is really cool. Murder investigation, JK. Just kittens, John Kennedy. This is actually kind of a cool, a cool little game. SFX, Shrimp Fryer, Steamed Facts. <laughs> there are two things of equal importance that are the most eye-catching. Can we not? Can we not do this? All I'm saying is, fuck this little bitch. The fuck? Out of here, Monica. Fourth girl, bro. Fourth best girl. Thanks for joining us, Lube. See ya. Yeah, bye. It was nice having you here. Stay safe, Lube. Why do you keep saying stay safe to me? We ain't in no hurricane. I let her in first and take my seat by her next. By her, by her sides. All right. You have hobbies not related to literature? I, I do, but well, is it something hard to explain? Yes, it is. Um, yes, cutting yourself really just is, you know, it, it, it doesn't come up in, you know, conversations with, with people you just meet. Sayori, the sun, the, the sundle, the sundle of bunshine. I, <laughs> why does that sound so fucking stupid? It has literally been like a month since I've recorded this mod. <laughs> I've been playing it like in my off time because funny enough, there's a lot more than the whole like bathing suit shit <laughs> which was the biggest promotional point of this mod you actually get to pursue any of these girls and you have like a whole ass like week you go through an entire week we're on the last day so i wanted to record this part look how much better this outfit is compared to the first one we got like crazy right crazy bruh, bruh. a week has passed since i first went to that pool with sayori and monica nevertheless my thoughts have been occupied by the things said between yuri and i yesterday yeah dude we almost fucked yesterday that shit was crazy that shit was bruh, dude don't even get me started it's not like she fucked your dick or anything dude you just almost kissed her right and then her mom fucking pulled up i'm excited to see what kind of cute swimming outfit natsuki has bro we ain't pursuing that hoe though we ain't even going for her. You thinking about more than one girl at the same time, this guy? Get out of here, bruh. I mostly wonder what Yuri would look like in more revealing clothing. I can't deny. I agree with you on that one. What can I say, bruh? You're your best girl. You're your best girl. Before arriving at the entrance, I get a text message. It's from Natsuki. It, it reads, I won't be at the pool today. Don't look for me. Have fun. That's totally because we pursued Yuri, though. That sucks. That sucks. It'd be like that, though. Like, if I'm being honest, G, Yuri pull up, Natsuki pull up. Who the fuck you choosing? Come on, like, come on, bro. <laughs> Stepping inside, I hear an older sounding man groaning to himself. The sounds he makes give me an uneasy feeling. What's my man doing? I decide to not look at what he's staring in the back room. Coming back to the pool, I decide to look for the girls. They're not in the pool. Not anywhere around it. As soon as I turn around, I see a gentle flash of white and purple in front of me. I can't play this game. I can't play this game. This, this suddenly feels like more than I can chew. <laughs> Hello? Whoa. Uh oh, real life woman is texting me. <laughs> Get the fuck away from me, bruh. I'm too busy looking at pixels. I hope my attraction to her smoking hot body doesn't become visible. E bruh, what, bruh. What's this guy talking about, bruh? Is it me you're looking for? And now I'm actually looking for Monica. Do you know where she is? Sure, lead the way.
dude. <laughs> That's crazy as shit. Was I really staring at her that long? If I was, I thought she would have said something sooner. Except, no, she's not like that. At least I don't think so. Our playtime was fun, but I wouldn't say it was very eventful. Admittedly, it was nice to play side by side with Yuri. Side by side? How about like top and bottom? Sorry, misconceptions about what it really like. Yeah, yeah. so she, this bitch is trying to get me to join her fucking club. Meanwhile, Yuri's over there looking like snackage. So I'd like to ask you to consider joining us next year. Yo, maybe I'm team Monica now. <laughs> what? Bro, what? I recognize her by that beautiful flowing purple hair. She's lying on her stomach in a lounge chair, bathing in the sun's rays. You see, I tend to burn quite easily in the sun. I was wondering if you would put some motherfucking lotion on my fucking back type shit. I gotta get a gotta get a grip on what? <laughs> a tender grip on her with Nope. Nope. It's funny when I make the joke, but when you do it, it's not funny. There's a thumbnail right there. <laughs> oh. Bruh, what the fuck, bruh. Lube, I was wondering whether you would come looking for me. Yuri gives me a coy smile. I feel something behind that smile. I just can't figure it out what it is. Should we make our way to the locker room? Whoa. Uh, do you mean the locker rooms? Oh, man. <laughs> her eyes motion towards the door of the men's locker room. Wait, did she just... No, I must be overthinking things. She can't be serious, right? My mind goes blank. My body takes over. I push open the door. Wait, hold on. What's, what's happening here? She leans in, slower than before, but this time, never leaving my gaze. With only two pieces of... <laughs> That's so crazy, dude. Okay. I might need to stop this soon. <laughs> Okay. Okay. Not bad. We got the puh. If, I, if I'm being honest, guys, besides like that second day where the writing was really weird, the writing in this mod was probably the best writing of any of the mods that I've played. That was, it was really good. I'd say play this mod. If you can pursue each individual one of these girls and get a different story, I'd say definitely play this mod. If you can use the Wayback Machine to get the fucking <laughs> download. <laughs> so we're going to be playing... Uh, another mod for Doki Doki. Uh, it's called Rain Clouds. It follows Sayori's point of view during the main game. And, like, the shit shit that she goes through. Apparently, it's really fucked up. <laughs> like, kind of scary. More just really disturbing. What's the name of your childhood friend? Check that out. Obviously. It's your boy, Lou. Who else would it be? I have trouble breathing. I feel so numb. I don't want to open my eyes. Not again. Another day for me to wake up for. No. I can stay strong for lube. I've got to. I'm doing this. Oh my god! <laughs> so much for a calm night. <laughs> Fuck. That scared the shit out of me. I was not expecting anything like that out of this mod. God damn it. <laughs> I slowly take in a deep breath and call out to him. Hey. Yo. It's the be it's the first day, that's sick. I wave my arms around, trying to get Lube's attention. It's time for me to wear my mask. Lube sighs and lets me catch up with him. He looks embarrassed. Hey, yeah, it's me, check me out, bro. I'm looking dapper as fuck, got the tie? Hell yeah, red tie, looking like SpongeBob. His little blue shorts. What the, f what, what? You say that like you were thinking about ignoring me. He was going to ignore me. Does he really hate seeing me that much? I can't blame him. 
I wish I could just go to the literature club already. It's so much more peaceful in there. If only, maybe. By the way, Lube, have you decided on a club to join yet? A club? I told you already, I'm really not interested in joining any clubs. I haven't been looking either. That's what I thought. I want him to come with me, even if that- <laughs> I approach his classroom. As I get ready to enter, I hear him muttering. Clubs. Am I gonna have to come in? I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry for coming to bother you again. I'm not even that interesting. <laughs> Sayori. Yeah? There's no way I'm going to your club. I just want to bang my head on the floor and scream right now. I'm so worthless. Hoping for him to come. Uh, Meanie? I show my biggest smile. And I swing open the classroom door. Why do you look so weird? Why do you look so weird? Sayori always says nice things about you. Lube doesn't seem to care about the last part of your statement. <laughs> Come on, bruh. You know this game is- Oh, dude, the soundtrack- I think this is the best soundtrack to a game I've ever fucking played. Like, I listen to this shit at work. Write a poem to bring to the next meeting so we can all share. She glances at Lube. I look at him too, smiling, but he only notices Monica. Damn, bruh. Damn, bruh. I'm so sorry for you. Guys, do you know a Sayori? Have you, have you ever had a Sayori to your lube? Because I have. Let me tell, I'll tell the story. It was literally like kindergarten through fifth grade. I knew this girl named Martha. And she, not only did she look like Sayori, but she also acted like her. Um, not with like the depression shit, I'm pretty sure. But, uh, <laughs> who knows, man? I mean, we were kids. But she she was so happy every time she saw me like it was very obvious that she had a crush on me and shit um i didn't like her like that though i don't know why but she was always saying this this hyperactive shit like to me acting like we're the best of friends and, and, and it was just flirty shit but i would i did not like it at all um I don't know if, if I'm just the oddball and that I actually have a, an experience with a Sayori, a poem. I wish I could find something to write, but no ideas come to mind. I feel like maybe I can make something pretty decent. What would Lube like? Ooh. Interesting. I'll just go with something happy. I'll just work on it for a bit and see what I can come up with. I sit at my desk, then grab a pen and a sheet of paper. I can do this. Hey, nighttime type shit. I'm thinking out loud. I'm just stupid. For a brief moment, I think about something. Something wrong. No, 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 no. Why does it hurt so much to stay quiet? I want to scream. If only, if only Lube could be here right now. If he saw my pain. Would he help me? Would he regret acting this way? He'd feel sad. He'd feel regret. I can't tell him. That'd only make him sad. I throw the little bits of poem in my bin. I take a deep breath. I'll try writing a cute poem. The club is used to it, after all. I've got to stay strong. I can do this. I know. I know I can. I... Oh, fucking... Sayori, do you really think things are that easy? You can't find one positive thing about yourself. I want to scream. What is this? Where am I? You're so hopeless. Lube doesn't care about you. Isn't it clear? Why do you hold on to that hope? You deserve to suffer. You deserve to see him happy without you. You deserve to be alone. You deserve... Enough, enough, please. Oh, fuck. <laughs> hey, yo, is that Monica? Yeah, that's totally Monica, bruh. I, I can't breathe. I'm sobbing uncontrollably. Everything feels so strange around me. No, no, please. I can't stand it anymore. Those bad dreams. Oh, fucking holy shit. <laughs> oh, my God.
Carbonated dicks, bro. That's crazy. I should go out and take a stroll. It's not like anybody will need me today anyway. Where should I go? I wonder. Ooh. To the park, the mall, or the cafe, boys. I kind of want to go to the park. I just want to see the river for a bit. It's been years since Luke and I went there together. Hey, yo. Let's get some... Let's get some anti-boggers in chat, bro. Let's get some anti-boggers in chat for Sayori. Speaking facts. Fuck Snapchat memories. Lube would always grab my hand and guide us towards the river. I fell in there once. I thought I was going to die. But Lube jumped in and saved me. Those memories are so heartwarming, yet so painful. Why did he change? Is it my fault? Maybe I'm the one who's changed. I approached the fence. It was so hard to jump over it when we were kids. It would be so easy to do now. It'd be so easy to fall in. Oh fucking holy shit! Guys, this is not funny. That one genuinely fucking got me. I don't want that to happen again. I think I just need to go to school. I should be able to make it to the literature club on time. Maybe I'll be able to relax and uh, blah blah a bit there. I'm on edge now. I'm starting to read like shit. <laughs> Check me out. Bum, 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 bum. Don't worry, guys. Loop always gives it his best as long as he's having fun. Hey, where the fuck did your eyes go? Minori is my favorite character. Minor? You like minors, Naksuki? You into minors? She's 18, so it's a funny joke. Trust. <laughs> but it gets especially bad. Oh my god! Did I fall asleep? No, I don't think so. I... What is... Oh, fuck! God! Damn! <laughs> <laughs> I think the last thing we did was uh, Natsuki invited us to go to the movies with her. So that's where we're at right now. Is there something in particular you want to watch? Who goes to the cinema without an idea of what they want to watch? I Look, I literally did not go to the movies for two years. My first time back at the movie since Spider-Man Far From Home was Spider-Man No Way Home. I didn't go for Black Widow, I didn't go for Shang-Chi, whatever the fuck, Eternals, who the fuck cares about that? I, I was about to go for the Resident Evil movie. About to, <laughs> about to go to O'Reilly's, get some auto parts. <laughs> That's sick, bro. That's sick, bro. I hope you enjoy the auto parts. He's already walking towards the nearest cafe. Damn, they have so many custom, like, places in this one. I love it. Natsuki orders an orange juice. I do the same. <laughs> why, why an orange juice? You're going to a coffee place. What the fuck? <laughs> she looks so embarrassed. What is she about to say? I'm apprehensive. She deeply inhales. Oh shit, boys. What if I told- Oh my fucking god! <laughs> Head over to Twitch, boys. Head over to Twitch. Sayori, are you alright? I look at her and I smile. I already knew that, Natsuki. What do you mean, you knew? It was obvious. And to be honest, I think Lube really appreciates you too. <clears throat> Dude, life's life's chilling, man. Life's chilling. I'm uh I'm working a lot. I'm working a lot. I got cheated on a couple months ago. Crazy. Uh <laughs> that's pretty the pretty much the biggest things, I guess. Um Yeah, but um I mean that's about it really. I lay down, tired, my eyes slowly close. Ah, I fucking knew you were gonna show up, you fucking twat. Of course there's nothing you can do about it. You'll die alone. Who was that? <laughs> but I don't want to face my fears again. I exit the park, half running. I feel- You mean jogging? <laughs> I open the door and I step in. Bro, this is so dark. I don't like this. Cold. Why is it so cold in here? Holy shit! Don't do that. Don't fucking... I, the door just closed? Just... What is happening? <laughs> no. There's no way this is real. What do you want from me? I just want you to understand that you should give up. Is that too much to ask? I didn't do anything wrong. I'm just trying my best. I glance at the closet. I slowly walk toward it. 
Is this what I wanted? Is this what it wanted me to look at? <laughs> a rope? I'm shaking. I think I know why it wants me to take the rope, but I can't. I won't. I slammed the closet door. I'm not doing this. I don't want to leave Lou behind. I'll, I'll take it, but leave me alone, please. Good. See, it's not that hard. I try the door once again, still closed. I open the closet, I open the closet core, and I grab the sturdy rope. I don't remember seeing it here yesterday when I came in for the supplies. I hide it under some books in my bag. I'll just throw it away as soon as I get home. I head for the exit. The door finally opens and I run outside. Simp alarm? No, 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 no. Guys, good content, guys. Good content. I don't know if you guys noticed. You probably didn't notice. But I've been taking, like, I've been taking all the clips from my... Don't wee-woo-wee-woo me. Don't wee-woo-wee-woo me. I've been taking all my clips from my, my Doki mod streams and putting them into, like, a, a super cut, you know? I think... <sighs> Is look, I'm gonna be streaming it. It's not like I'm playing it with my dick in my hand. Like, come on, get out of here. Get out of here. My dick's not gonna be in my hand. I'm gonna keep them both up the whole time, I promise. Luke, we want to see the summer mod. You know what? You know what, bread boy? I wanna see the summer mod too. That was you and me dapping up. Visualized, of course. I think I'm going to use this webcam from now on, uh, this webcam microphone. It actually, it's, it seems pretty fire, um, as far as I can tell, uh, nothing wrong with it. Um, so, uh, let me know if you guys have any complaints about this. <laughs> Did you happen to hear me and Lube? I feel a chill go down my spine. Why am I so scared? No, no I didn't. Why? Was it important? Liar. Wow, what is she saying? How does she know? Oh, holy fuck, bitch. Are you cool? What's up? I didn't do anything to you. Oh my god, relax. What the fuck am I looking at? Just as I thought, I broke down in front of Lube. No. No, not Lube. How could I, how could I do that? Not in front of Lube. That cute motherfucker. The ground below me is dampened by my tears. Suddenly, I hear something behind me. God, you fucking stupid whore. Point where I can't even stand properly. Eee, what the f- Yo, come on, bruh. My body is paralyzed. Ah, okay. <laughs> Just finished shoving these cocks down your throat? I open my bag, and I get ready to throw the rope over the fence in the river. Why won't my hands let go of it? I don't want to keep it. I don't want things to end this way. This can't... Right. My voice is soft. Why do I sound so calm? No matter how hard I try, my hand won't let go of the rope. Alright, Monica. Where are you at? Where's she at, though? It's, it's kind of become like a, like, a, like a fucking tradition at this point for you to show up and talk shit to me and, and bully your girl. I'm allowed to have fun, after all. I had a good night's sleep. I look at I look to my right and see Yuri walking towards me. Hey, hey. Do you know why you feel the need to hurt yourself? Uh please don't hate me if I tell you. Why would I hate you, Yuri? You're allowed to have a little rain cloud from time to time. You see? Seeing Lube and Nasuki happy together really makes me sad. Oh, I mean, I don't want them to be unhappy. It's just that I appreciate Lube's company, and seeing him stay with Natsuki all the time just hurts. I'm sorry. I'm just being stupid. That's not stupid at all, Yuri. How am I supposed to respond? I feel the same way. God damn it. Sorry. <laughs> we haven't been jump scared in a minute. Something bad's about to happen. Indeed, it should be. That's weird. Yuri takes out her phone and looks at the schedule. Oh my god. I'm so sorry, Sayori. Why is she looking all panicked all of a sudden? Did something bad happen? What's wrong? Is the train late? You don't have to apologize about that. I, uh, 
I misread the schedule, and there's no more trains until tomorrow. Oh, is that the problem? Oh well, man, don't worry. Let's make this an adventure. Truth is, I'm kind of worried. But after spending such an amazing day, I'm sure everything will be fine. Bro, that's crazy. I actually went through something kind of similar. I pressed... Okay, happy thoughts. What's up, Monica? Oh my fucking god, bitch. Whoa. Oh, hell nah. Oh, hell nah. I got goosebumps on this one. I got goosebumps. I, wow, I really don't like that. And did you really believe that I enjoyed our time together, Sayori? I've had one of the most awful days of my entire life. Looking at landscapes? Spending time with friends? Do you seriously think I was looking for that? No, I was just trying to get some more information on Lube. I know how you feel. I know you're in love. She can't, though. This is nothing but a bad dream. It'll it'll be alright. At least you got that right. Oh my... I did not like that one. Suddenly, I hear Lube's door open. No way. He's heading towards my house. I couldn't even change my clothes yesterday. What will he think? My door slowly opens. Look at this goober. We haven't seen this fucking goober in a brick. Brick. And he's in his fucking school uniform. What are you doing in your school uniform on a motherfucking Sunday? You fucking goober bitch. I'm telling you that I'm fucking depressed. And I have a rope in my closet that I'm about to use to hang the fuck out of my motherfucking necky. Did Lube leave the door unlocked? Weird. Can't afford to hurt anyone else. I'm sorry, did I scare you? I saw Lube getting out of your house, so I thought I could come in. Uh, since we worked, to, we have to work on the posters, remember? Oh, the posters. So she wanted to meet up? How come she didn't even text me? Oh, uh, yeah, sure. Why don't we go to the store and get some? I'll pay. Plus, I'd like to breathe a bit of fresh air. Alright. Bro, how long is this fucking mod? I'm trying, I was trying to fucking finish this, and then we were like, oh, let's go to a different fucking part of Japan. <laughs> you know, to hang them. Rope? To hang? Ah! <laughs> is something wrong, Sayori? Sayori? Hmm? Why don't you jump? Oh my... Fuck. What? What are you saying, Monica? Why don't you jump? You have an opportunity to die right here. You can still fix what you did. You won't hurt Lube anymore. One move and it's all over. Or are you too weak to do it? What, what did you say? Monica, you... Are you alright, Sayori? You're all out of breath. Are you feeling okay? Do you want to go home? So this is when we confess our love to Lube. Obviously, we're going to skip this. Because uh, she's just going to be doubting herself the whole time. We want to see what happens after this. I know what you need the most right now, and that's what I'm going to give you. He thinks for a second and looks at me. Sayori. I love, what? Really? That's what we're going? That That's where we're going with this? That's kind of unexpected. I hurt Lou by adding another burden for him to deal with. I hurt Monica even though she was trying her best to help me out help me this afternoon. And I even hurt Yuri by acting selfish at Euro. In the end, I'm nothing but a failure. A fucking failure. You're a failure. One cut. Two, holy shit. Ten cuts. What the fuck? Wow. I keep cutting my arm until I can't hold my scissors anymore. I'm so sorry. Tears are streaming down my face. I don't want to. I really don't want to. But it's like this world just keeps torturing me in order for me to for me to leave. So this is it. I'm weak. I throw the rope on the floor, tear a page from my notebook. I grab a pen and I write a few words. Now everyone can be happy. That's crazy as shit. Holy fuck. <laughs> Seeing the rope hanging from the ceiling like that, it makes me shiver. But this is it. This is my fate. This is how I... How, this is how it's supposed to end. That's what I deserve. It's my fault. It's 
God, I need to learn how to read, I swear. It's my final punishment for being so selfish. I climb onto my chair. I grab the noose with my two hands. I don't. I don't want to do this. I can't be weak. For once, for this time, I can let myself be weak. I can do this. Not for myself, but for everybody else. We will finally be relieved of this burden. I put the noose around my neck. I'm so sorry. So sorry. Sorry. Why don't I jump now? What's preventing me from doing it? Just one little push and it's over. It won't hurt. My hands tighten around the noose. I... Can we can we save her? No. No, I can't do it. My crying intensifies. How can doing such a horrible thing help me deal with my problems? I love him so much. How could I think for an instant that I could scar him like that? I'm not doing this. Never. Lies. It's all lies. Hey! I step forward, off the chair. I end up kicking it down. I don't feel anything. My throat hurts. The pain is horrible. But I can endure it. Because this is my punishment. It's so weird. This is a feeling I've never experienced before. Why am I being so calm about this? I should be screaming, crying. But I'm not moving. Hey, uh, oh my god. No. Wait, no. No. I don't want this. I try to untie the rope. But it's just too tight. My hands are bloody. And they're way too slippery to get a proper grip on the rope. Please. Any anyone. Help. I can't cry. I can't do anything. It's like my body isn't even mine anymore. Please. Just let me be next to Lube one more time. I promise I'll be a better person. But please save me. I regret. It's all my fault. I decided to do this. It's all because I was too selfish. Maybe if things weren't differently, then Lube could have saved me. My hands feel so numb. I'm so sorry. I don't want this. I swore I wouldn't do it. Yet I did it without a thought. Without even saying goodbye. I won't even get to see Lube's face again. I... I love... You. I want my last words to be for Lube. In the end, I was wrong. I saw things my own way. At least now. Everyone can be happy. Damn. If that wasn't the fucking longest mod I've ever played in my goddamn life, <laughs> that shit took forever. But it was good. It was good and bad. Uh, it was good. It was a very good mod. Um, damn. That's, I don't feel as sad as I probably should be. But, you know, it is what it is. It's a good story.